it's time for launch. Hello humans and animals alike, this is Dylas, and welcome back to Spyro Year of the Dragon. It is time to board the rocket and head off to the last area of the game, Midnight Mountain. But I think you know the drill by now. The sorceress has other plans. A monster to end all monsters. That's it. I've had enough. I'm going to create a monster to end all monsters. <laughs> and I'm going to send it out to destroy all the dragons, even the little hatchlings. Yes, yes! Huh? It will smash them and crush them and grind them and tear them! Oh, yes! Smear them and smoosh them and crack them and crease them! But, uh, won't that kill them? <laughs> that doesn't matter, as long as I can still collect their wings. What? All this time you've only wanted them for their wings? Of course, you ignorant girl. I need them for a spell, so I can live forever. Uh, uh, wait, wait a second, a, a spell? What did you think I was going to do with all those dragons? Open a zoo? <laughs> you said just keeping them in our world was enough. You never said you had to kill them. I don't have to kill them. It just stops them from wriggling so much. You're terrible. I can't believe I ever listened to you. Stupid, insolent brat. I'll take care of her as soon as I finish off that dragon. Now, where was I? Ah, yes! Uh-oh. <laughs> No! No! And so another battle begins. Yeah, the sorceress's true colors have now shown. She is a heartless one. This might be our last stand, Spyro. The sorceress plans to use this monster to destroy every iota of her opposition, beginning with the two of us. Alas, there is no time for ruminating. A battle awaits us. I will endeavor to assist you by means of a steady provision of combustible projectiles. So... missiles, right? This is Scorch. Not to be confused with the level in Spyro 2. It is the sorceress's ultimate monster, as far as we know. So, yeah, for this uh, battle, watch out for the shadows. Be sure to avoid them. Ah, nuts. Ah, no, not the crabs. Get out of here. Ah, nuts. Took too long there. Oh, these guys. Whoa. That's a lot of crabs. Ow. I need help. Ow. And I died. Yeah, this... this guy's pretty tough. Okay, let's get the missile here. Fire as best we can. Okay, homing missile, and I missed. 
I'm really not good at using those homing missiles. Play with your eyes like that. You're in the middle of a battle. Oh, crap. Whoa! Wh what was that? down. James. No giant peach to be found, though. Oh, wow! You breathe real fire! Excellent! The Escape. Hi, Bianca. Did you bring any more food? I'm starving. There's no time for that, Hunter. We have to stop the sorceress. She's gonna kill all the dragon hatchlings. Wait a minute. Why should I trust you? This could be another trap. You're in a cage, you furry numbskull. How can I trap you by letting you out? I don't know. You sorceress types can be sneaky. gonna hurt the dragons. Come on, we don't have time for this. All right, time for the final world. Midnight Mountain. Prepare for landing. Oh, hey Bianca. Spyro, I know you don't trust me, but I want to help you stop the sorceress. There's a way to open a hidden portal to her lair, but it'll take some very strong magic. If you can find more of the dragon eggs, I think my magic will be strong enough to open the portal. I'll come find you when you have enough eggs, okay? We actually do have enough eggs. In order to challenge the sorceress, you need 100 eggs. And I have 101, so that's great. All right, let's see. Anything in here? Yep. All right, let's go around here first, and there's an egg on this little island. Saki Amamiya! I'll tell you about that island later, viewers. In the meantime, let's go over this way and find scumbags again. Well, well, Spyro, look what I have here. It's a life-size space monkey action figure, complete with a fully operational laser. <laughs> I'd love to let him out so you can play with him, but the sorceress seems to think he's a menace. I see. 1,300 gems! Nah, you can keep him. You don't want to free him? Oh, what's the matter, little dragon? Are you just jealous that no one's ever made an action figure out of you? Alright, let's, well, let's, let's free him. 
<laughs> You've always had a weakness for helping silly little creatures, haven't you, Spyro? Oh, well, I suppose there couldn't be any harm in letting him out, could there? Dude, you've been, like, this is the fourth time you know what's coming. The dancing bear. No! <laughs> Hell, it's your lucky day! Check this out! No! <laughs> Alright! Good answer, isn't he? Not much stamina, though. Too bad I had a lot more ammo left. <laughs> Anyway, I heard all about how you've been fighting the sorceress and her armies and kicking all that butt, and I just wanted to say, huzzah, yippee, woo Wish I could stay, but my home world's been overrun by Rhinox since I've been captured. If you happen to see the sorceress, tell her I'll be giving her dancing lessons real soon, know what I mean? You bet. Later! Well, he's got a bunch of pep in his step, don't you think? Yeah, unfortunately, Moneybags doesn't seem like much of a dancer. Alright, we'll be visiting Agent 9's lab at a later point. In the meantime, let's be on the lookout for some more gems and eggs in the Midnight Mountain homeworld. I uh, might as well toast some of these lizards to, like, potentially get some extra lives. I wonder what that magenta liquid is supposed to be. Some other kind of lava? Oh, I see you! It's another egg thief. I feel like I haven't seen those guys in a while. All right, let's go. Ah, almost. There we go. My can. My, can I give you a hug? Ah. Oh. Ow. <laughs> Okay, let's get more of these uh, urns here. And there's our extra life there. Let's see, there's a crack in the wall. Let's bust through it. And we save Billy. The adventures of Bayou Billy. Okay. Let's go this way. Ooh, sneaky. Oh! I never noticed that was like a, uh... That looks like a snake holding a crystal orb there. Another Sparks mission we'll have to backtrack for. Of course we'll be doing the one in Evening Lake, but we'll be saving that for next episode. Hmm, now that I think about it, next episode is gonna be somewhat bloated, isn't it? Well, unless I do the speedway this episode. Hmm. How should I handle 
Here, yeah, there's a cracked floor here. Head back. And we get some gems. And rescue our buddy! actually uh, mention the gem requirements for the other uh, levels. I forgot about that. So, Haunted Tomb requires 70 uh, eggs, Dino Mines requires 80, Harbor Speedway requires 90, and of course the Sorceress's Lair requires 100. Uh, Oh, wait, don't go this way yet. I want to glide over this way. And there's a special door here, and we need everything in the game thus far in order to go in there. 15,000 gems and 149 eggs. All right, let's see. Uh, did I see a... Uh... Okay, no. Burns. Oh. Hey there. You did it, Spyro. You found enough of the dragon eggs for me to unlock the portal. Once I've opened it, you can confront the sorceress whenever you're ready. But be careful. She'll be expecting you. I figure she would. Of course we're not going to challenge the sorceress right away. You can if you want, but uh, I'm not going to. We're saving that until after we're done with all the other levels in uh, Midnight Mountain. Oh yeah, I guess that's worth mentioning. Uh... Midnight Mountain is the only home world in this game where you can challenge the boss without having to complete all the other levels first. Evolution. All right, that's all the eggs. Now, what about the gems? Where am I missing gems? Okay, Sparks is pointing this way. Oh. Well, there we go. That's all the gems in Midnight Mountain. Alright, so with that... Let's see. How long have I been recording? Oh, it's only been 18 minutes. Yeah. I think now's a good time as any to tackle the Honey Speedway. Now, if you remember from last time, we couldn't do all of... We couldn't do all of Honey Speedway in Evening Lake because Hunter was captured, so we couldn't do everything. Of course, I could have theoretically chosen to do the Speedway early on in Evening Lake, but I didn't really want to do that. I wanted to pace the uh, Speedways out a little bit. Alright, so let's go on in. All right, 
Alright, so just like before, Honey Speedway, or Honeycomb Speedway, however you want to say it, has time attack and allows you to race the bumblebees, both of which give you an egg as a reward if you finish them with successfully. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we'll just go with the easier route first. So, honeycombs first. The honeycombs are right over here. Uh, let's just continue going through this way. Oh! Hey, there's Hunter! <laughs> we'll meet up with him soon. Alright, so now we do the bees. Alright, and now the bears. We'll go this way so we uh, take care of them faster. And don't fall into the honey. That count. That, uh. That lets you be disqualified when you fall into the honey. Alright, we did it first try. Not bad. Alright! Chris. Chris McLean. Alright, let's see. We'll race the bumblebees this time. Fly through the green rings, use the red dots to guide you, just like the other times. Er... Oh, yeah, it is just like the last times. Alright, so... Alright. We basically already know what to do here. Try to go through the blue stars as they will give you a speed boost. The red stars will put a missile in your mouth so you can fire it at the uh, other racers. Let me see if I can hold on to this one. Alright. Third place. Oh, seems we're uh, activating the honeycombs even though we are not doing the time trial. There we go. Slowed him down. Yeah, I don't think I ever mentioned that you can use your fire breath on the other racers. I mean, if you could fire missiles at them, uh, using your fire breath on them would make sense, but I seem to forget that you can do that. <laughs> Alright, and 
and now uh, we're in first place. We just gotta keep the lead. Don't try to do anything too fancy. Oh gosh, that made me really nervous. <laughs> I just said don't do anything too fancy. Because otherwise we're going to be automatically disqualified and we'll lose. I lost my way! Oh my gosh. That- that was embarrassing. Can I still win the race? Let's see. I might still be able to. Yes! All right! Yeah, even after that embarrassing mistake, I still won. Whew! <laughs> Dumblebees. We rescued Henri Matisse. Another bubble breather. Don't worry, it'll be useful one day. Alright, next up we're gonna go see Hunter. Let's see, where is he? Should be around here somewhere. Ah, there you are. Look out, Spyro. There's a really big sheep UFO around here, and it's trying to get me. I snatched up a dragon egg it was trying to abduct, and now it wants revenge. What is it with the sheep? You wait here. I'll lure the UFO down the river of honey. And then what? Go ahead, I'll cover you. Okay, here I go. Okay, so... Yeah, we can jump, just make sure you don't hit anything. Otherwise, well, the UFO is gonna get you. Nobody outraces a cheetah. And look, I didn't even drop the egg. Nori. Now to find Dory and Ori. Alright, well, that's it for Honey Speedway, I guess. Yeah, sorry, but we got some other stuff to do. Like finding more dragon eggs. And treasure. So, with that, Evening Lake is finished. Well, actually almost. I forgot we do have to backtrack here one time with Agent 9, but... We'll leave that for another time. So with that, 
next time on Spyro Year of the Dragon, we are going to go to... Hey, wait a minute, there's actually more business we can do here. So, yeah, we'll take care of the Sparks mission first while we're here, and then we'll go to Agent 9's lab. We'll do that for a change. So, with all that said, thank you for watching. This is Dylas signing off. See you next time.